Hello and welcome to Unzi Talks where I bring you one great book in two short minutes and the book I'm talking about right now is Hotel on the Quarter of Bitter and Sweet by Jamie Ford and I have two reasons for recommending this book. Firstly it's emotional impact and secondly it's significant insights. So this is historical fiction um, and yet it also bounces around in time. So it moves between two generations one in the 1940s in World War II era San Francisco, and then the other in the 1980s. So the the um, children, Henry Lee, Henry Lee is one of the characters in the book. So Henry's children's generation is the 1980s storyline. So I love that it moves around in time like that. And the author uses that to, to his advantage to kind of keep you in suspense. So he'll shift to the second generation and tell you a bit of that story. And then you move back in time to the first generation. So to tell you a little bit, bit about these characters, <clears throat> They're Henry and Kiko. Henry is Chinese and Kiko is Japanese and they live in San Francisco um, in the early 1940s. And of course we also know that it was in and around this time that the Japanese bombed Pearl Harbor. And so Kiko's family, being Japanese, um, was in a very compromised position and they were sent off to internment camps. And so the friendship between these two young people um, is what really drives the plot and also the prejudices between um, the two different cultures, the Chinese and the Japanese. So that's another reason why I believe that you know the significant insights of this book are notable because you learn about World War II but you also learn about global history, you learn about the history of other countries um, and how and why there was um, animosity between the Chinese and the Japanese cultures as well. So. If this sounds like it's something that would appeal to you, I would add it to your TBR pile. And until next time.